Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to generate any of the stairs by using the Stair Builder plugin in iCron 7. It is really fast, really productive. You can generate any of the stair with any of the variations just in one minute. So start from now, I'm going to show you how to step by step generate the stair. First, you have to scroll down, go to my video descriptions, click into this link get stair builder plugin from this link once you click into this link you will go into the Revolutions website this is a Revolution marketplace search from here click here and search for stair builder then press enter Next, you should be able to see a stair builder is here. Click here. First, you must have a Realution account and log into your Realution account. This is zero point. It is totally free of charge. You can just click buy, and then go to go to the cards and click proceed to check out. This is totally free. Click place your order. Next, you download the plugin. Once you click download the plugin now, it will download as a zip file. Just need to click start download. Alright, if you are not familiar with how to install any of the free plugin for your iClone 7, I already, cr I already created a tutorial for you. You can just scroll down to the video description and click into this link. And check the tutorial how to install all the free plugin for iClone 7. I already show you step by step how to download and install any free plugin in very details. So once you already install it, install the stair builder in your in your iClone 7. Now, in order to generate any of the stair, you open your iClone 7. I assume you already installed it. Just need to go to the plugins and you can find from here. It is under G2 Stair Builder. Okay, now you can see a few variables are here. In order to generate the stair height, this is two. Let's say I click build. The total width, the total depth, we are going to test one by one to build. So now I click build. And what you need to do is just wait for a while until it finish generate. Now you can see the stair is generated. Go to the scene, you can see all are just a single prop selected at different different place here. All right. In order to compare it, what I'm going to do is I press Q and I select everything. I move to here. I press W to move to another side. Now let's say the number of steps, if I change it to become 5, what will happen? We test it one by one, I click build. The total height I may just choose as 1. And I build it. I just need to wait for a while. Now you can see this is a, a new stair. Its height is only half of the previous stair. The height is one and how many how many steps is totally five? Alright now I select this, I, I press Q and I, I move this to this side. Alright now the total width is one. If I make it become two, what will happen? And if the number of steps, sorry, the real height, I put it as 0 0.4. What will happen? I build it and see. Let's have a look. You can generate different stairs. All right, now you can see. The total width is 2, now it is, it is bigger than the previous stair. Okay, now I press Q, I select it to move it to another side. 
Now what else? The step thickness, I'm going to choose it, uh, I'm going to make it become 0 0.1 and the, the real height and now you can see the, the real height is this part. It is taller already. So what else you can you can do? The total height I put it as three and I click build and let's have a look how many how big is the stair will be. Just have a look. It is really awesome. You can generate any of the stairs. Let's have a look. Alright, now you can see this is a different stair. You have different stairs here. This is really awesome. You generate different types of the stair. Alright, this is all, all the demos about how to install the G2 stair builder and how to create any of the stair, any of the custom stair in your Icon 7. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D animation and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you will receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy happy animation and game developing. See you.